What's up, everybody? We're back to the video. Are you all playing a three point contest? Nothing like it, folks. The All Star festivities in the air. Kevin Harlan here with partners Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. Let's get into the Mountain Dew three-point contest. We'll see who has the steadiest hands, the steadiest nerves to secure the victory. And ain't no do-overs in this competition. When that clock starts ticking, you got to be ready to deliver. And I love it when the fans start seeing the guy get in the flow. These shooters want to find that rhythm to get the crowd to go along with them, and then the spectacular happens. So here's Lillard now. Each competitor will shoot their way through five racks and two balls from the do zone. Those are worth three points apiece. The money balls are worth two points. One of those at the end of each rack. Not to mention every ball on a money rack of the shooter's choosing. So you've got a maximum possible score of 40 points and just 70 seconds with which to work. So you have got to get them up quickly. That's four misses in a row. Pick up the pace, Ooh. young fella. Not great. He's growing a little bit cold here. No good. That's eight straight. Another one off the mark. That's nine in a row. That's meter jet, right? He's missed his 11th straight. He's completely out of sync. Misses his 12th straight. Just a terrible stretch. There's eight. Ten points so far. Four straight hits. Hits his fifth in a row. He posts a score of 14. Well, a very respectable performance from him there, guys. I guess. So it'll be Devin Booker here. The competitors have 70 seconds to work through five racks of five and two long balls. Those are worth three points apiece. Money balls are worth two points apiece. The rest are worth one point. And one rack of all money balls at a location selected by the shooter. Interesting to see where they station it. Most shooters have a certain spot on the floor they favor. Yeah, tough time getting going right now. He's got 11. Makes it 13. And that's going to put him at the tippy top of this round. Two racks remaining. That's four misses in a row. That makes it 16. Up to 17 now. There's 18. Can't sink the money ball there. 19 total points now. He's now hit 20. And with that round over, he sits with 22 points. He went out there and knocked him down. A terrific round. Yeah, and that streak in there, what, six in a row where, where he was really feeling it? That speaks to his confidence in this event. 22. And so will see James Harden. And the do zone provides an added challenge. Most players wouldn't risk those shots in a regular game. Luckily, these guys aren't most players. For some of them, that's a shot they're very comfortable with. No good with his fourth in a row. Trains the money ball. Bad luck. He's getting cold. Five consecutive misses. Here's eight. Nine. And he's got ten. He could have taken more from that rack. Only got two points. Uh oh, Harden's starting to feel it. He's at 14. Now he comes away with 16 points. That was a nice piece of shooting we saw from him out there. And he struggled with his deep range, but those do balls falling off the mark. 16 so far. So it's Luka Doncic now. 
Well, the KO comes at 13, so 14 will keep him alive. Yeah, that score can't have him too worried. Well, I'm guessing he'll top that without much of a problem. Eight points is all he needs. He's at seven now. Here's eight. Nine points for him right now. Five more points to stay in it. Four more points to stay alive. And that makes it 12. Two more points to stick around. Goes one of two on the two ball. He's tied for second. Good for second. 18. He got three points off that rack. Not bad. Hits his fifth in a row. It's tied up. And with that shot, he moves into sole possession of first place. He's on top. His nope. final score for the round is 23 points. What an incredible round. He was absolutely yeah, red hot. And he managed to hit four money balls. Not terrible, but, but could have been better. And so we'll see Kyrie Irving. Got to have at least 16. A great shot here. Not the highest score to Gets the money ball. Shot from the Four. That makes five. He's at seven now. He might run out of time. He's at eight points. He needs eight points more. There's nine. Eleven. Needs five to stay alive. Here we go. He misses his fourth straight. Five more points to stay in it. And now really starting to get cold. And that makes it 12. Only four more points to stay in this. He finishes with a total score of 12 points. That's far below what he's capable of doing when he's on his game. And any time it looked like he was starting to get into a good rhythm, he would just as quickly fall out of it. And here we go with MP. It can be a big advantage going last. He knows the score he needs to beat in order to qualify. And 16 points, the bare minimum, if he's to advance. Oh, man, I, I think he should be able to pull this one out. Find that flow. Six. That's seven. Misses on the money ball. Misses with the first two ball. No good with his fourth in a row. That's five in a row. He better get it together. No good on his sixth consecutive shot. Eight is enough. Ten points so far. Two racks to go. Five more, and he advances. And that makes it 12. Makes it 13. Three more points to stay in contention. 15 points now. That moves him to third. Couldn't finish it off, but still put up an impressive number. So he's got 19 points. An outstanding round. He looked very comfortable. Yeah, that long string of six misses, which is pretty long. And anytime you miss the equivalent of more than a full rack in a row, that's uh, bad news. Doncic has got the honors of being able to go into the finals as the top scorer from the qualifying round. These scores so far have not been incredible. You, you'd think the rim was crooked the way these guys have all been struggling. Not the shooting clinic that we expected to see so far, but the finals might just light a fire under these guys. And here we go with MP. He's got to improve on his score from the last round if he wants to have a shot to win it. At six. He's at eight points. Got to get all the shots off. Nine points for him right now. And he's got ten. 
11. Going too slow here. He needs to dial it up. Twelve. Makes it 13. He's at 14. Only one rack left. 16. 18. Ran out of time there. His uh, score sits at 18 points for the round. He had his shot good. on automatic. That's why he's in this contest. So it's Devin that. Booker now. And when you think of some of the great moments in this NBA three-point contest, Larry Bird winning the 88 contest wearing his warm-up jacket has to go down as one of the most iconic moments from this event. Well, there's no question about it. And the best part about it is when Larry released that red, white, and blue ball and held up that gnarly index finger, number one in the air and number one in your hearts, winning that competition that year. There's nine. Eight more points for him to tie it up. Can't get the money ball to fall. And good on the second do ball. Four more points and it's time. Last rack, he just needs one more money ball. Up to 17 now. One more to tie. So he's got 19 points. Oh, hey guys, an impressive showing from him in that one. Scary. And with that make, he's now the one to beat in the final round. It's got to feel good to be out ahead. Yeah, that's awesome. He's positioned himself very nicely yep, here. So oh, it's Luka okay. Doncic now. He was the hottest shooter entering the finals, so he earned the right to go last. Mm. And he knows exactly what the target is. He needs 20 or more to win this thing. There's four. Five for him now. He's at seven now. He's at eight points. There's nine. Ten. Can't cash in on the money ball. Three racks down, two to go. No good with his fourth in a row. Seven more points and he'll tie it up. And that should just about do it for him. Yeah, he won't be able to come back from this. Well, better luck next year. Yeah, I put it on this year. He comes away with a total score of 15. And so we wrap up the Mountain Dew three-point contest. Hey, out of man, all the great marksmen, one stood out from the rest. And this year's champ, Devin Booker. Man, he had it rolling hey, at the man. right time and has to be happy with how it all played out. Well, you win something like this, and it's a great footnote at the end of your career to say I was the best of the best on that given night. And so from all of us here at 2K Sports, it was our pleasure to bring you this year's three-point contest. For Brent Barry and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching.